light. Save my soul. This is Alonsus Chapel in Stratholm. The day I became the first of the Paladins. Come, Uther. Take your spot so that we may begin. In the light we gather. In its grace, our brother will be born anew. Uther, do you vow to uphold the tenets of the Holy Light? I do. What are these tenets? The three virtues. Uh, respect, tenacity, and then... And then... Compassion. Seeing beyond our differences. Understanding our similarities. Feeling for those who suffer. Even if... Oh, Arthas. Wait. What is that? In the corner? This entire city must be purged. How? Oh. How can you even consider that? His memories are twisting together. We must help him. No, Clea. He must face this on his own. You are not my king yet, boy. Nor would I obey that command even if you were. Then I must consider this an act of treason. Treason? Have you lost your mind, Arthas? These memories... They are not one and the same. Do you vow to walk in the light and spread its wisdom? Hmm. Your grief and regret haunt you still, as does Arthas. Do you vow to vanquish evil and protect the weak and innocent? I... I do. Arise, Uther, as a paladin of Lordaeron. First of the Order of the Silver Hand. The Light. Arthas. What have I done? Feeling nervous, Arthas? Honestly, yes. I see your devotion to the Light, and feel doubt cloud my heart. You've taught me so much, Uther. But I sometimes wonder if I'm truly meant to walk this path. Great expectations await you, lad. I have faith that you will exceed them all. But for now, let's spar. That should clear your mind. <laughs> it always does. No. I should have listened to him. Why didn't I listen? You sought to comfort a troubled student. None can fault you for such an act. Tell that to all of the innocents he slaughtered. I set him on that path. You guided him on the path of justice. He is the one who strayed from it. May the light forgive me. Your wound, does it still hurt? It does. Perhaps it always will. What is this place? This is the moment of your death, isn't it? He came for the urn. The one that held the ashes of the father he slew. Why this memory, Uther? Why linger here? In that moment, I failed him. I did not uphold the virtues. Compassion, least of all. My heart had never been so cold. I faced him, not as a mentor, or even a friend, but as a bitter foe. Perhaps, but confronting this memory has taught you the value of compassion more than any scripture ever could. Take that lesson to heart, Uther. The past may be immutable, but the future has yet to be written. 
I will. Arthas, if only I had tried to save you. Face me, Uther, and I'll make sure you die quickly. I dearly hope there's a special place in Hell waiting for you, Arthas. We may never know, Uther. I intend to live forever. I dearly hope that there's a special place in Hell waiting for you, Arthas. We may never know, Uther. I intend to live forever. <laughs> Fate befell Arthas in the end. At the moment of his death, Devos and I claimed his soul and cast it into the Maw. Without the Arbiter's knowledge? So he might yet have had a chance at redemption? I will never know. It was not my choice to make. Devos led me down a dark path. Now that I have seen the Maw for myself, I cannot say that any soul deserves such torment. Perhaps some can never be forgiven, but you have shown me that they must be treated with compassion. Every time I close my eyes, I see my death. I see him standing before me, that cursed blade in hand. Devos convinced me that my death was wrong. She promised me justice. What we did to him was not justice. It was vengeance. Lysonia was no different. I did not know that they wielded the same darkness. Thank you for showing me mercy. I will not forsake it. We all have much to learn, Uther. Come, let us speak further at my temple. I sought answers, and found only anger. There is much for me to consider. My memories still haunt me, hero. I am still too old for this nonsense. Put your faith in the light, and all is possible. Don't test me, child. <laughs>